Democratic presidential candidate Sen. Kamala Harris DCA addresses a crowd at the 2019 South Carolina Democratic Party State Convention on June 22, 2019 in Columbia, South Carolina. Photo by Sean Rayford, Getty Images, Democratic Presidential Hopeful Sen. Kamala Harris has just released a plan that will address how to keep guns away from domestic terrorists. It comes in the wake of the two-year anniversary of Charlottesville and the recent mass shootings in El Paso, Texas, Dayton, Ohio and Gilroy, California in the last few weeks. Senator Harris, formerly California's top prosecutor and San Francisco's district attorney, said that if elected president, she will push for passing a law where an individual could petition the federal courts to temporarily block another person's access to firearms if that person is suspected of plotting a hate crime or making racist, anti-immigrant threats. Harris is also proposing new measures to expand background checks to major online gun retailers, and her plan outlines tools and resources for law enforcement to combat hate-fueled domestic threats. Read more, Sen. Kamala Harris shares her 2020 agenda for the black community during an appearance on Fox News Fox. The FBI director testified last month about 850 domestic terrorism investigations ongoing, a number of those with racially motivated, violent extremist ideologies behind them. Under Harris's proposal, she plans to reverse President Trump's dangerous efforts to deprioritize countering white supremacy and commit $2 billion to investigate, disrupt, and prosecute domestic terrorists. Take executive action that would require major online gun sales platforms like ArmsList.com to perform background checks. Create a domestic terrorism prevention order so law enforcement can petition a federal court to temporarily seize the guns of a domestic terrorist or individual who may imminently perpetrate a hate crime. In America, loaded guns should not be a few clicks away for any domestic terrorist with a laptop or smartphone, said Harris. Read more opinion why I support Sen. Kamala Harris for president, we need to take action to keep guns out of the hands of dangerous people and stop violent, hate-fueled attacks before they happen. By focusing on confronting these domestic terror threats we can save lives, in the plan released by her campaign on Wednesday, Harris vows to invest $2 billion to investigate, disrupt, and prosecute domestic terrorists in her first 100 days in office if she becomes the country's next POTUS. Let's block ads. Why?